Hey, it's the Awkward Professor here again with another quick art tip. Today we're going to create bricks using two-point perspective, the same way we would add them onto a building. We're just going to add them onto a cube, which is actually the same thing as a building in perspective. So on this sheet here, I've drawn my building already, or my cube. And all I did was have my two vanishing points. I created a vertical line, took my top and my bottom back to both vanishing points, create the top and bottom of my object. And I finished it off by creating two vertical lines on the outside to help create my object. Now, in order to create bricks using perspective, the only thing you have to do is go to your middle line and we are going to create a distance that we try and make even all the way up and down and then those tick marks there we're going to take back to our right vanishing point and our left vanishing point so we want to make sure that these go to our left vanishing point and these go to our right vanishing point in order to create bricks that's a very similar concept when we try and make uh, wood planks um, a variety of different um, unique creative things that you can add to your artwork. Always want to make sure that it lines up with our vanishing point before we draw any lines. Now I am stopping when I hit the outside wall of my object and the only reason I do that is because I don't want to have to erase all these lines. Um, I can show you here on these bottom ones that I want to make sure that I'm in line with my vanishing point. So I'll, I'll extend these ones out. But you don't have to do that if you know that you're lined up with your vanishing point. So you can see here that I line these up with my vanishing point but I know using my ruler or my straight edge that I've done that previously. So I'll erase those so they're no longer in our way or in our sight. And the next thing I'm going to do is I have to create the left and right side to my bricks. So all I'm going to do is use a vertical line and I'm going to create a line on every other brick because bricks are staggered when you build with them. So we want to make sure that we create that staggered look. And right now, we're just creating the one line. Now to create that staggered look, I'm going to line up just to the one side of where that line was. And I'm going to go to that other row of bricks that I didn't draw on. And I'm going to create a vertical line on those. As you can see, the bricks start to look like they're staggered. And your image will start to look like bricks are actually used to build the object. Now the trick is to always make sure you're on the right one when you're drawing, but sometimes you get off. We all make mistakes. Just have to keep drawing. So again, I'm going to line up. I'm going to hit every other one. I shift over. Again, every other row just making the one vertical for the one side of the brick oh looks like I have enough room to do one more and do that real quick here and then I need to do my empty row and remember the staggered so slightly off to the side of my other row and then every other one double check here I almost drew on the wrong one but there we go so now I have bricks on my object real simple concept all you have to do is remember to use your vanishing points and to be really consistent when you make your vertical lines well I hope this tip helps please subscribe